Welcome to my channel. This is Tony Godley, and thank you so much for joining me on today. Uh, if you have not subscribed, go ahead and do it now. Push the subscribe button right down there. And because I want you to stay up to date with what I'm doing, whether it be workouts, journal, just life journey, whatever. Um, I want you to be one of the first to know when I've uploaded something, so make sure you hit the notification button. Also, take the time to share me. There is enough to go around, so please make sure that you hit the share button and share this video out. So today is going to be back in biceps, and we're going to do it right down in my home gym, in my garage gym. Um, use some equipment that I'm going to make shift some stuff. I'm going to make some stuff up so that I can get that work done um, with some bands and things like that. And then I'm going to use some dumbbells and I'm just going to um, use a variety of tools where uh, we will definitely get the work done. Um, I hope that you enjoy this workout um, as I go through it. I'm just demonstrating. I'm not giving instructions. I'm not telling people they're doing things wrong or they're doing things right or uh, any of that. I'm just demonstrating what I do, okay? So, if you want to see this workout, please keep watching. Also, make sure that you use the comment section to send me any questions you may have, if you have questions about equipment in my gym, if you have questions for me as a older woman in fitness, um, just any, any comments, um, any nice comments will be appreciated. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button if you love this video. Okay, so I will see you momentarily in the garage. Okay, let's talk about this exercise. I've made a makeshift row machine, per se. So I'm using bands to do um, seated rows. As you can see, I'm squeezing my shoulder blades together. Um, I've done 10 to 12 reps, and I've done five sets. Next, what I've done here, as you can see, I've made a makeshift lat pull down with a band and a little handle. And all I'm doing here is going pulling down towards me to uh, work my lateral muscles and a little bit of my interior back muscle as well. And I do 10 to 12 reps there. Then I turn around and I immediately go into face pulls and I do 10 to 12 face pulls, which works the upper back and rear deltoids. Next, I'm doing lying bench um, incline flies. So as you can see, I'm working um, my outer upper back as well as in the center of my back. And now I'm doing bench incline rows. Each exercise, I do 10 to 12 reps four to five sets. Now here, I'm just doing the same exercise. The only thing is I'm standing this time. Um, my hands are still in the same position. I'm simply standing up and I am doing the flies 
um, 10 to 12 reps, four to five sets. Here on this exercise, I am on the bench doing rows with the dumbbells at this point. And as you can see, I have one knee on the bench, one leg straight out. Um, I am increasing the weight with each set that I do. I do 10 to 12 reps, four to five sets per arm. And as you can see, I keep my body straight. I keep, neither of my legs are moving. If you're pulling and using, bucking your knees, so to speak, then the weight is too heavy for you. You wanna always control the weight so that your um, lats and your rear deltoids is the one that's getting the work, not your legs or your hips. Lastly here, I'm doing rack pulls, and this was my very last set. This was my one rep max, um, and I did one rep of 350 pounds. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this clip, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notification so that you never miss any of my uploads. Again, thanks for joining me.